I'm Gaz, and this is Let's Play Man of War Corsair. I have done a Let's Quickly Play of this game before, uh, however, this is now several versions down the road, and uh, to be honest, not much has improved. Uh, this is going to be another one of my six pack series, and I was struggling to find something to play uh, for Halloween, so I figured that we could maybe do this game uh, with one of the Chaos factions, which is about as close as I think we're going to get with this. So let's start a campaign and a new game. So the differences um, thus far, over however long it's been, are uh, that you can now, instead of just being an independent sailor in the Warhammer universe, um, you can be Bretonian, Imperial, or one of the Chaos factions. So I'm going to go ahead and pick Nurgle because they look, I guess, the most Halloween-y. Um, and we'll just hope that... Well... I mean, I guess we'll just go with this. Uh, customization is still terrible uh, for this game. In fact, the game itself is... Well, it's not so good. Um, we'll go ahead and call ourselves Gaz... Wool, And uh, move on. So we'll just go with regular. Your coming has been foretold by the seers and prophets of chaos. It is known that you will one day rise to power before the world is scoured by the ever-chosen. For years you have pursued this destiny, raiding the old world and slowly earning the attention of Nurgle. After decades of bloodshed, you know that your time is nigh. You have gathered a respectable fleet of loyal followers and sturdy ships. You sail south, determined to earn the final boon of immortality and join the ranks of the Demon Princes. Eh, let's just pick that flag. And we'll call it, yeah, the Cataract, that's fine. So, the thing about the Chaos factions is that unlike the, I guess, normal game, um, you're basically all about raiding and pillaging and fighting. Uh, the trading and all that stuff doesn't really exist, as far as I know. Uh, if we look at the map, uh, they're, unlike if you're playing as an Imperial faction, um, there are not ports that we can go to. There might be. I don't know if we can go past the Sea of Claws up into Norska and all the Chaos uh, lands or not. Um, so I don't really know how we uh, redeem a lot of our things, but... There's their shrine. Ooh, this is a new thing. So, okay. So I guess I'm going to have to get some stuff. Okay, this is a little bit different. Um, anyway, we're going to explore this for a little bit. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm going to play as these guys for the entire time. I don't need to be transferring. Um, so we might swap off and just kind of play normally. There are a few missions that are sort of Halloween-y. Where do we want to go? We want to go down south. We're going to head through the Dragon's Maw. We are way out of place, and you can see there are sea monsters out here. We're not even close to sea monsters. Uh, we could head towards the Empire, but I think we'll we'll start doing a little bit of raiding and pillaging along the way. Um, we're going to have to probably speed things up, however, because there is a lot of travel time otherwise. Looking around, I see nothing but my fleet, which is, I guess, different than uh, the Imperial Factions begin with. We begin with an actual following, a war band. And there is a sea monster there. Why don't we go... Why don't we go up here? Because we'll at least get some stuff. And you can kind of see the... purple edging. Now, we have several weapons. we got a prow weapon, a stern weapon, and of course our port and starboard weapons. They are, however, not cannons. They are catapults, which are less precise, and uh, frankly, I feel a lot harder to deal with. Now, we've slowed down, so we must be within territory. The monster must be around here somewhere. The music is changing. And the guys are talking. So, somewhere out here... For the plague father, okay, but oh Jesus! So if you watch my let's quickly play, the monster that the tutorial kind of deals with is um, a megalodon. We are about to run smack dab into a uh, sea serpent, which, interestingly enough, I can still see. Well, I could. Oh, that's something I'm going to have to do. Hold on. Uh, so, you have commands now. Um, we're going to have to command the fleet to attack the Sea Dragon. 
This is actually kind of a cumbersome way of doing this, I feel, but that's how it goes. Um, you'll see here there are anti-flyers. One thing that they apparently added to the game uh, was that Chaos... Well, I mean, not just Chaos. I guess the Elves factions we're going to have to fire. We got some of it. Did you see the damage it's done to its head? Um, they added, like, flyers and, and uh, other more interesting, less ship-based things. Um, combat still really sucks, though. Why am I... F okay, I was going to say, why am I flying so far out? Is that what... That must be what V does. Well, that's much more convenient. For finding... This creature. Uh, my front end, however, is completely destroyed. Does that mean the weapon's gone? Uh, sort of. We turn so slow. I'm going to... Raise sails. Okay, we we did not get that. Uh, trying to I'm trying to get uh, my side catapults, which are no longer. Is that what's been destroyed? Is that why I can't get them? It must be because it's only allowing me to get the forward and the rear. I mean, you can look at my ship there. Ooh, 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 damn it, turn the other way. Okay, there's a little bit of damage that's been done. And it looks like... almost looked like we lost a ship there. Blood on the water, so we must have hit it. It's here somewhere. One of my minions. Plague gores. Ah, shit. So now, uh, this is hard without side weaponry. Fortunately, it is attacking, attacking one of my ships, not me. Uh, because we've already taken some damage. My crew is repairing, though. If you look at that, my cannon that's on that... That must be my... Okay. I thought the uh, those cannons would be more centrally located on my ship. That is not apparently the case. Um... What is red on my ship right now is those cannons, or catapults, whatever the case may be. So it looks like the center of my ship has got the steering wheel on it. So the helm is in danger if I get attacked in the center. You guys even doing anything? We're kind of out of the wind right now, so if I want to gain any maneuverability, we're going to have to come about the other way. I don't necessarily like that you guys are getting close to me, because that means it's just going to trigger that much more on me. Big surfaces, where is it? Oh, there it is, oh shit. Well, I mean, on the other hand, that's good, because we have... Oh, damn it, don't go firing on it. I mean, I, I kind of want them to, but at the same time, I don't want them to. Although I suppose that's much more effective if it's traveling after me. Do we have side cannons yet? Yes! We're we gonna hit it though. No! Damn it. Turn back around. I don't know if I'm in range there. See, it moves so fast. That's what I, I find very difficult to. Oh shit. It is not happy. Okay. So let's not ram our own guys. That would be preferable. So kind of milling around. We need to not be turning that way. We'll be turning out. I wonder if I look at that map. So it actually does kind of tell me. I mean, this is obviously the territory, but it's actually telling me where it's at. I wish that mini map was a little less mini. Oh, jeez, it's up. was. It seems to have gone down immediately. Turn around. It's still on the port side. There it is. I cannot extend past my ship. There! Hopefully not hit my ship. Got him. Very nice. Come around, and there should be goodies on the surface that I can pick up. There are those beaming lights. Well, we're going to have to go into 
yellows to get there. The uh, the winds switch often in this game. I'm not sure I really enjoy that. Um, the game also does recommend tacking, which is a real thing. But I'm not really sure that it's actually too effective in the game. I don't really know how you how you do it. I guess it's otherwise just zigzagging. So you gotta go way out and then you gotta way back in. Okay. Awesome. So we look at that, we have cleared basically everything in the sea. Ooh now, hey. You can see there's another plague faction. If you mouse over these territories, we see that this is allied territory and it's being lightly patrolled. If we come down in here, we're gonna see that it is controlled by the Bretonian faction. And is that still Bretonia? So if we come this way. I wonder. The thing about uh, the Warhammer maps is that they are often rotated differently. I'm used to seeing a map where the Empire is kind of on top. I guess Sea of Claws is up here. We're actually... See, the Elf Home would actually be more out here, which is kind of where that wood is. I was thinking we were more north because of the orientation of the map. Um, most of the orientations you'll see are focused on the Empire. Kind of, this would be up here rotated differently. Sea of Claws would be going to the north. Why don't we head towards the Sea of Claws and start fighting the Empire? Um, getting anywhere, though, is going to be a long shot, so why don't we go actually go down here? Uh, we'll go pick on Hinde and then make our way up and out, although it might be easier to escape. The thing is, once you raise a town, um, all the fleet's faction, or the faction's fleet comes after you, and so we go do that and then try and get out of here, and the wind isn't favoring us, we're screwed. Uh, so maybe we'll go down here and hit Chantillion, or Chantillion, uh, instead, and then that way we can maybe at least escape out here. Heading down to Marienburg looks like a death trap, because how do you get out of this? I feel I'm not really 100% sure on how to really make this more effective. Oh, another thing, um, normally you would go into port, See, the wind is not going to favor me if I'm going that direction, though. Maybe we should just keep going with these guys and just keep heading down the coast of Bretonia. Because when I switch over, and I think I'm going to switch over, um, we're probably going to be doing most of our stuff over here anyway. So let's continue on with these guys and see if we can't catch up over there. And maybe we can find ourselves another, another sea monster, if nothing else. I kind of want to go, well, you know, we can go ahead and hit them in uh, Urgai. We'll have to go through those, but we'll get there. That doesn't mean there's not going to be someone else out there. We are... Oh, it's coming towards me now. Interesting. I wonder what that portends, whether or not it's just going or... You can uh, choose ooh, hey, uh, to take the captain and go muck around. Um, unlike the Empire faction, I don't get a ranged ranged weapon, a ranged weapon to uh, switch to. I am pure melee, which kind of sucks. I do not know what this is or how to utilize it. And where else are we going? Nowhere. I'm not sure I can actually even utilize this part of my ship. Who are you? Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Um, 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 let's slow down here because I feel like I'm about to run into something. Okay, in fact, if you look over there on the minimap, there's a yellow ship. So let's, oh yes. Yes, we've met a, a Bretonian, and it looks like my fleet is engaging on its own while I'm dicking around. So, that's really cool. I probably could have gotten there on my own without having to run up the... I think if I just switched, that was really good. It probably would have jumped me straight to there. I wouldn't have had to run all the way back up. Okay, I'm going to have to really start leading. And there's another one coming in. Ooh, they're all coming in. We've entered territory and they've found us. Who is that? 
Um, I'm gonna guess that based on that color that it is... Oh, hey, wait, wait, wait. Uh, so, patrolled in strength by Bretonia. We are currently witnessing allies of Nurgle. But I'm thinking that that might be Slaneshi. Seems how it's not red. Oh, you bastard. Okay. These guys are really hard to control compared to just shooting cannon. I Did I just hit my own guys or is that... Now here's another one coming in. Gotcha. Okay. Another thing about being Nurgle is that uh, our ammunition apparently spreads plague, which I guess makes it easier for boarding. You bastard. Okay, we're gonna go hit up this ally here, which kind of seems to be... You look at the direction of all these ships, and they're all scooting around, but I think we want to get these guys. Right oh yes, I keep forgetting I have front weapons. We took a few hits while I was screwing around. Now that Corsair is heavily damaged. So... Of course it's gonna... It's at a disadvantage because it should be heading into the wind. Or, yeah, into the wind. Um, not having it. We've delivered Nurgle's gifts to the ship. Board it and complete the infection. Shit. Well, if I can get it boarded before the other ship boards it, that would be great. And I can't pull my damn catapult in closer. It looks like it's being boarded already. Well, shit. And actually, we are now heading into the wind. You cannot do double jeopardy, unfortunately, and board an already boarded ship. We can blow it to pieces, but I don't feel like we want to do that. In fact, we have currently... I should really be utilizing this because this is what tags the ships have someone to go after. Um, so we'll just skirt on by and clang into that because the hitbox is bizarre. Triumphant succumbed. Hooray! Does that mean it's one of ours? One of us. One of us. I feel like that and you can see that uh, we're all engaged upon that. I do want to kind of get into melee combat. I would like to board something. Come on, come on. We're going to have to lead this one. How much, I don't know. Um, anyway, one thing I, th I think I was getting at, and I failed to, uh, failed to finish my thought on that, God damn it! was that, um, unlike, you know, the Imperial ships, which can dock and whatnot, can we, can we board him? Can we board him? Board. Aha. Okay, let's go. Um, we have to basically cannibalize in order to repair and gain new recruits. Yes, combat is still atrocious in this game. I don't understand it. It is stiff and unnatural and from like about 15 years ago. Haha. Oh man, I am. You just spawned out of the damn mast. Which makes me wonder do I have to find the captain to make this stop? There's another one coming. Aha, uh -huh, captain. Turn you around so that my buddy buddy can hit you in the back. I feel like there should be more, like shield bashing, and there's really just so much more that could have done. Okay, Captain's dead. Awesome. Uh, Lady's Virtue will transfer all of it. I assume we're going to leave it. I guess we have to scuttle it. That sucks. So how the hell do we... We must have to uh, infect it, then. Alright, well, we'll scuttle the damn thing. Shame. I would like to have increased my fleet. Speaking of fleet... Um, did we get that one? The Triumphant. It looks like it's... I mean, it's a different color. Did we take that? 
It's to come to the... Uh, what is that? I mean, I want to know. Captain Lappin. So, it's just a plague ship now? It, it's still got the faction's symbol on it. Are they just infected now? I mean, there's another ship, though. Or another uh, faction symbol on it. You see that? Like, it's got... It's double imaged there. The superating wound. Nope, that appears to be a another Nurgle ship. There's one there. Should we turn around and fight the Ostlin? I mean, I guess we can. Looks like it's a big one. Why not? Let's have some fun. Well, maybe we'll do... Uh, ooh, I, I mean, I, I see some explosion out there. Hmm. Anyway. Let's turn about. And take on the... Incoming ships. Okay, the Paladin. Does that imply it's sunk? It must be sunk, that little symbol there. But that is an Imperial ship. That is not a Bretonian. So let's go test our metal on this. And spread Grandfather Nurgle's gifts. Trick or treat. Nope. Yeah, see, th now we're at the advantage. Now I'm going to have to try this tacking thing. Spread way out, and then actually, if I spread way out here... Um, now that cannibalizing thing, and the, uh, the rating, obviously, I think only work at, uh, oh my god. Okay, we don't want that thing turning around on me. And he's got the wind. Which is not so good. Incoming, the triumphant. I wish I could... Why does it do that? I wish I could get more... Oh, there we go. Bretonian Trader Corsair. Well, what does that mean? I don't know. The Ostland, Imperial Trader Wolf Ship. Okay. The Lord... Ooh. We probably don't want that one. That's a five skull. It's a, it's a galleon, too. This is just a trade ship. It's got 15 tons in the hold, though. So, that's a good loot ship. Can I hit it? Absolutely not. And those greedy bastards have boarded it before me. I am the captain here. Or I suppose since I have a fleet, do I count as the admiral? Not Commodore. Interestingly, um, did you know that Commodore is not actually a rank? It is uh, a rank given to a captain when a captain is on board a ship with another captain, because there can only be one captain on a ship. I don't. I don't want to go. F weighing on that because oh, no. okay hold on I wonder if we can can we board <laughs> on the other side that'd be a little bit ridiculous I don't think so okay we have to we have to be tacking here otherwise we're going nowhere so maybe if I turn in here about on this. And I can crank around to the other side real quick. I wonder though if I can just if I cannon that. If that has any impact. Ooh, hey, do you see do you see the uh, the symbol up there in the top left? I wonder if that implies that I've throwing plague onto it. No, that must be where my faction guys are. Those are some heavy hits, though. I don't want to sink it. I'm, all I'm trying to do is... It's got one crew on there. One crew of 16. That must be the captain. The Ostland has succumbed. Hooray. So it's got my plague on it, so... It must just... Leave it in peace to deliver its many gifts. Okay, yeah, so that's what we do. Interesting. I wonder how the other factions deal with that. If 
for those that don't know anything about the Warhammer universe, um, the Chaos Gods all kind of have their own domain. Uh, Nurgle is obviously about plague and rot. Um, the other factions in this game are Corn, who's slaughter and um, or murder, and uh, who else? Slanesh. Slanesh is all about um, hedonism. How? I mean, do we give chips tentacles? Is that how that works? That'd be interesting. Maybe I should do that instead. Uh, we'll try out the other chaos faction and see what's what. What is that? Uh, well, I mean, obviously another sea monster, but I don't know what that is. So far, I have only seen two sea monsters, the Megalodon and the sea serpents, or sea dragons. Um, as far as krakens and other things, I don't know. Cool. So, those are my weapons, then. My front and rear weaponry must be for devastation, and when I'm throwing the green globs out my port and starboard... Uh, those must be for spreading plague? Or do they all spread plague? I don't know. The Gallant. The Gallant is another trader. 13 holds. Or thir 13 tons in the hold. I have no idea what that one is incoming, but, uh, well, let's, let's speed up and see. Oh, I, I don't need to speed. Oh, no. Oh, God, I thought it was right there. How the hell does that happen? No, we will, uh... Okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. We gotta go. Gotta go down. Feel like we're moving a little too fast. Slow down. Um, not, not, not F, not F. Go, keep going. Come on. The gallant, the captain Gaston. So, actually, get my, get my guns out because it's going too fast, and we're not going to be able to hit it. Wow. Well, we can probably board this sucker if I can. Do not, do not hit me. Board the gallant. Excellent. There are other ships out there as well as cargo. Um, can I just drop off the dam? Is that gonna hurt me? Oh, come on. That's, uh... Oh, my. Oh, those are my guys. But those aren't out there. I wanna know what those are. Chain ship. You poor bastard. I don't know who this Carl guy is, but, um, he's just kinda hanging around with the plague. Get, get off. Get off. Get. Haha. <laughs> don't. Oh, fuck. I just lost my own guy. Hey, bastard. What are you doing? Yeah, I don't know. Carl's just hanging out. <laughs> God. Would you just... War priest. War priest looks like me. Oh, sorry. Sorry, Carl. I almost got Carl. Okay, now it's... Now it's the captain. Nobody dies to the gifts of Nurgle like Gaston. Transfer that. I really wish we could take these. That'd be way cool. Why do we need food? I guess Carl. Carl's the only one that needs food. Scuttle the ship. What I would like to know is who we return these penance. You know what? Who do we do this to? Petition. Uh, petition Nurgle to send an additional ship to your fleet. Awesome. We've got favor for this. Okay. Uh, Allied Plague Crusher, or a Death Galley. What's a Death Galley do? Icon of Power. What does that do? I don't know. Cultist. Carl must be my only cultist. We could get Spawn, destroy a port for the glory of Nurgle. Ah. Crew is full. Uh, is it not full? Oh, my crew is full. That's why I can't get fire. Okay. Uh, Chaos Warriors, Champions, Beastmen, Allied Plague Ships... Elite cultists, elite beastmen, streamlined hull. Okay, so that's cool. Well, let's use this to get a death galley. Um, something tells me that this is going to be hard to utilize, although maybe it's got a prow that it can ram. I don't know. I don't think I have one, so we'll add one to my fleet. That, do you see that? That looks bad. That looks way bad. Um, sacrifice. Sacrifice food? To gain? Um, oh, it looks like we got scum as well. Gr scum, Grim, Svart, Konal, Carl. How come I'm only seeing Carl? Adun, Hrothleaf, Gunolf, Gunjorn, Gunjorn, and Vestar, and Ragnar. Oh, wow, we've got a lot of guys on board. Far more humans 
than I was expecting. Um, I mean, I could do the one gold bullion, because who the hell am I going to turn this into? But it only gives me five or eight favors, so let's not worry about that. Let's uh, let's screw around with some of these other things. Crew, uh, apparently have not earned anything. Why do we have beastmen? I feel like beastmen would be more suited to... Marines, I mean, these guys, obviously. Ship maintenance, 89% effectiveness. Well, because you've got sausage-fingered beastmen trying to repair the ships. Why are they not part of the, uh... Hmm. I wish you could see... I mean, obviously, I think these are just themed. I don't think this actually means anything. But who knows? I mean, maybe Connell was very good at rigging. Beastmen are an interesting lot because um, I think there's two different types. I think there's ones that are just like naturally created through other beastmen, or however they spawn, and then others are, are mutated men, the Ungors and the Bistagors and whatever. Okay, well you got a shield. Um, is there a reason you've got a shield and you're not? Can we give that shield to somebody else? I don't know how we deal with crew maintenance. How's the ship? Weapons upgrades. We have no upgrades, and I don't know where we go to get upgrades. Captain, that's me. Captain Detail. Uh, inventory. Chaos Warrior's Sword. I assume, Outfit 1. I assume those are for me. That's probably what I'm currently wearing. Uh, quests. We have no quests. Okay, well, anyway, let's uh, let's commit to this massive fleet action. I'm not sure... Buccaneer, Corsair... That one, I mean, that one alone. I feel like we should get the hell out of here, if I'm honest. The wind would favor us if we had headed down to Ergai. So I think I want to do that. Ooh. Oh. 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 Oh, interesting. So I can just let it go and... So if I wanted to go down here, it's going to bend me around there. It's going to engage me in these guys. Well, you know what? I... I'm hearing crashing. We have to turn about. Or do we? Where the hell? Why is the compass showing that direction? Let's go kill the Borderloo. Borderloo. Oh, that's behind me. Where the frick am I going? Well, anyway. Um, yeah, so I guess that's uh, Nurgle's shtick. Instead of raiding this, I think we'll come in with uh, the corn faction. We'll give that a shot. So I'm going to end this one here, and uh, we'll do that next time.